Hey, what's up everybody? You know, since we got so much time on our hands, I think I'm going to start making more videos or working on more videos. I can't say one every day because it's a lot of work, but uh, I'll try and make one or a few a week, maybe one every other day or something like that. So here goes. Yes, yes, yes. Who would ever thought that there's a National Empanada Day? Like what the you see all the stuff we learned by staying at home and looking at our phones all day? For crying out loud, I absolutely love empanadas. You don't need any of those forks or those utensil shits. All you need are these. Did you know that there are over 30 countries with variations on the fluffy ball of goodness? And just like its cousin, the burrito, you can ensure that whatever they stuff inside one of these bad boys will definitely arrive at its final destination, your mouth. Yes, I said mouth. The name itself comes from the word empanar, which means to bread or to cover in pastry. They make them with chicken, beef, tuna, even fruits like apples. Whether they're baked or deep fried, it's good, it's good, and it's good. Heck, with our current situation, why not make some at home? It'll be fun and something to do with the family. Your biggest issue might be finding a recipe. If you think about it, we've been around many variations for years, like Hot Pockets, Gyoza, Pierogies, even Egg Rolls. So that's my short video for today. For those of you that thought this video was cool and you learned something, please like, share, and subscribe below, and stay safe out there. Most of all, take care, and aloha.